What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Team Fish Knuckles YouTube channel. Today is Expanded Thursday, and today we are looking at a Magnet Zone Pikachu Reiku deck. Um, so let's go over the deck. Now, our kind of main support is going to be Magnet Zone. We've seen this before with Magnetic Circuit. You attach as many light energies as you want from your hand to one of your Pokemon uh, over and over again. So we're going to use this to power up our Pokemon. Now, we do have the other Magnet Zone. As you see, we're playing a 4-1-3 line. This other Magnet Zone has dual brains. During your turn, you may play two supporter cards. So the cool thing about this dual brains Magnet Zone is you can use like the Skyla to get something crucial, like a, like a superior, and then use like a Sycamore because you can use two supporters for a turn. Or maybe use a Fisherman and then a Chorus, so that way you can use Fisherman to put four energies from your discard pile into your hand. And then you Chorus to draw a bunch of new cards because you have a full bench. And I really, really do like this combo. If you're going to play Magnezone in Expanded, make sure to play this Dual Brain Magnezone because it's worth, it's really, really worth it. Um, just using two supporter cards over and over again. It's really, really cool. Now, our two main attackers are going to be Pikachu EX. It has Iron Tail, Flip a Coin until you get Tails. This attack does 30 damage times the number of heads. So if you flip six heads in a row, you could do 180 damage. Or its main attack is going to be Overspark. Discard all Lightning Energy attached to this Pokemon. This attack does 50 damage times the number of energy cards you discard. So you could, uh, you know, discard four Lightning Energies and do 200 damage, which knocks out the majority of EX Pokemon in the game. If you discard five, that pretty much knocks out everything. So uh, Pikachu is going to be maybe our EX Sweeper to constantly knock out EX, po EX Pokemon. The only downside is it has 130 HP, so it can get easily one shot it back. Now, our other attack is going to be Reiku. We've seen this before. Thunder Lights, 50, and then 20 more damage for each Lightning Energy attached to this Pokemon. And it has Shining Body. If there's any Lightning Energy attached to it, damage done to this Pokemon by attacks, or damage done to, to this Pokemon by attacks is reduced by 20. You play two Shaman for the setup, draw TF6 cards, and one. Caldeo. Now, some people might be saying, why are you playing Caldeo? Well, you still need the Russian effect, just in case they do. Lice Tender by Magnezone, and it has a 3 energy retreat cost. Or, let's say your Reiku, they flip a coin, like, they play Laser, your Reiku stays asleep, and then you have to, you know, if you don't have Caldeo and Russian, you have to just hope you flip heads, because if you flip tails, you can't attack for the turn. So that's why Caldeo is in the deck. And that's all the Pokemon in here. Uh, next up, we're going to be Trainer, Supporters, and Stadiums. Now, we're going to play Computer Search because you can discard two cards from your hand. Search deck for any card and put it into your hand. Really, really good just for consistency. Four Rare Candy. I might actually bump this down to three. Uh, we still have four right now, so you just kind of get that. Try to get that guaranteed uh, turn to Magnezone. One Super Rod. Shuffle three Pokemon and, and or three, it, three cop. Oh my goodness. Shuffle three in any combination of Pokemon and basic energy from your discard pile back into your deck. We've actually seen this card come back into standard as well and played in expanded. Three superior energy retrievals, and this is where I think the deck shines in expanded. A lot of people are saying, why aren't you playing Pikachu X in standard? And, you know, you just don't have that much energy, you know, come back. Like, you do have Fisherman to get your energies back, but superior, you discard two cards from your hand and put four basic energy cards. Four basic energy cards from your discard pile into your hand. Can't choose a card you discard with the effect of this card. Now, this way you're going to discard, you know, maybe, I don't know, two bad cards. Get back four lightning energies. Put those on Pikachu X and use uh, Overspark for a knockout. Just making sure, yeah, it's four. So, basically, you know, four lightnings is basically 200 damage. Now, you could play Execute. Execute has the ability Propagation. When it's in your discard pile, you can put it back into your hand. I just don't know what to cut in this deck for it. If you want to focus more on just Pikachu EX, you could cut a Reiku for a third Pikachu and the other one for a uh, for an Egg if you want to do that combination. Or if you want to go more of a Reiku route, you could cut a Pikachu and then the other one for an Egg. It's up to you. Four Ultra Ball to search out your Pokemon. Four VS Seeker to reuse supporters. One Coerce because everybody has a, uh, a big bench nowadays. You know, four to five, you're guaranteed ten. One Fishman, we've already been over this. You put four basic energy cards from your discard pile into your deck. Now, this card is good, but it's even better with dual brains, you know, because you can Fishman. You can actually double Fishman. You can Fishman, dual brains, dual Fishman again to get eight energies back into your hand if you need to. One Hex Maniac. 
I'm kind of on the fence about this card. We might switch it out for something else. It's definitely good if you're playing against another deck that uses like uh, abilities to power up the Pokemon like Bronzong or Blastoise. Or you're playing against the Mirror Match. You could Hex Maniac them as well to stop them from using it. Uh, but it's, right now it's kind of been a dead card. I could maybe see it cut being cut. One Lysander, uh, three in, four Sycamore, pretty standard. Maybe four four line might be needed. Two Skyla to search for any trainer card, reveal it, put it in your hand. Now this can get out, you know, rare candy, super rod, superior, ultra ball, computer search. Actually, what you could do is you could Skyla for a verse seeker and then use verse seeker to get any supporter card with the Magnezone. Or if like let's say you have course already in the discard pile, but if you don't have course in the discard pile, obviously you can just Skyla. Or a course and put in your hand. Because uh, you can grab all of these cards, which I do like a lot. Uh, you could grab Tropical Beach. And Tropical Beach lets you draw. You have seven cards in your hand. It's kind of hard to read. They kind of messed up the card. Uh, but once during each player's turn, you may use a, a, basically the effect of this card. Draw, you have seven cards in your hand. And you end your turn. Um, which, you know, seems bad, but turn one, you're not attacking with this deck. You have to rare cane into the Magna Zone, so you need a turn of using the Tropical Beach. Two Flow Stone to give Keldeo free retreat and ten Lightning Energies. Now, if you have any suggestions, let me know about this deck. I've been, t I've been tinkering it for a little while. I did have a Drachi, then I cut the Drachi. I did have Reiki EX in it to do 100 damage to a bench Pokemon. We did have Tool Scraper, we had Zero Six. Um, just what do you think some changes are to this list? Like what changes would you make to it? Uh, let me know down below in the comments and we'll probably play this deck again on Sunday. I didn't have that much time to play this deck as I wanted to. I unfortunately had to go to work really, really early tomorrow morning. So I have to go to sleep be to bed pretty quickly. And I didn't have that much time to find, you know, the best of games and to find the best list. But I promise on Sunday we will do another revamp Sunday. We'll play the deck again. Um, right now, I'm actually liking it without Pikachu EX. I'm not really using Pikachu EX that much. But maybe play like a 1-up for the Overspark if you need to. I'm just having a lot of fun just loading up a big Reiku and take a knockout so that way. Uh, but definitely, the rate, the Pikachu is worth his weight in gold. Uh, so let me know down below in the comments what you would see. And if you think it's fine, if you're like, I understand the deck, I don't want to see another one on Sunday, I'll play a different deck. So just let me know what you want to see on Sunday. Uh, maybe I'll think of something creative to do on Sunday. Because Sunday... It's an open day. I still don't know what it's going to be. Uh, I was like Sunday showdown where I was going to play the showdown VGC. Uh, but I just, I don't know. It's hard for me to play the VGC. I just don't understand it. Um, maybe revamp Sunday or look back Sunday where we look at other decks from during the week and replay them. Maybe like the most favorite deck. I don't know. Uh, we'll try to figure out something for Sunday eventually. Right now it's just whatever random video I can put up on Sunday. It's what we have. Maybe Sunday will just never be anything really. And it'll just be a day of rest uh, for me just not have a video. And maybe if I do have a video, we'll have a video. But hopefully you drew this deck. And let's see the deck in action. Alright, we're putting against Nick Wynn playing a Dark Fire Dragon. And something else. That's so many different combinations of uh, uh, energies. Or not energies. Of Pokemon types, but we'll see what they're playing. And we won the coin flip, which is great for us. It gives us the opportunity to get the Magnemites down turn one. And then use Tropical Beach to maybe hit everything we need. Uh, but with this hand, this is, uh, man, this is a rough hand for sure. But we'll see what Nick Wynn has here. I'm not sure what kind of deck he's playing. And we have the advantage, which is good for us. So we'll see what it is. And uh, well, he's got another basic Pokemon put down. We don't, sadly. And we both get six prize cards, and let's start the party. There's a Sableye and a Hydrogen. Huh. Alright, so Ultra Ball discard in, and a Skyla. Of course, this will get out a Magnemite. Okay. We'll put that guy down. We will actually Floatstone the active Verse Seeker for a Skyla. And we will Skyla for a Tropical Beach, and we have the turn two Rare Candy Magnezone in our hand right now. So we'll grab Tropical Beach, put that down, and we will Tropical Beach, drawn up to seven cards, all right. So next turn we got the Reiku, we got the Rare Candy Magnezone, we got a Lightning Energy, we can Verse Seeker for a N, uh, there we see, I think it's an N, or it's, yeah, an N. There we see Professor Letter, gonna search this deck for two energies, but what kind of deck are we playing against? Uh, Sableye, Hydrogen, uh, they would see a Dark and a Psychic Energy. And uh, let's see what else they can get. Also, next turn we get Ultra Ball for a Shea Bait if we want to. 
If there is one in the deck, or you might get another Magnemite down. There we see a Dark Energy going to Sableye. And... Oh, just talk for each one. Okay, so under our turn... Oh, okay, cool. We, we talk to the Magnemite. We'll put down the Reku. We will Rare Candy into Magnazone. We will use the Mag... Um... I guess we'll go for Magnetic Circuit and just end my opponent down to six so they get one less card in their hand, if that makes any sense, because right now they have seven if we end them down to six. But they didn't play a supporter card. Oh, man. I think going for the Anastas is the best play right now. We could Ultra Ball and not hit Shaman and then Cry, so that's why I'm going to go for the end. And uh, regardless, we didn't hit what we wanted, so put down the Reku, and we will just Tropical Beach. Ending our turn. Um, if we top just the dual brain magnezone next time, we got the rare candy or an ultra ball. We can get that the dual brain magnezone, and we can be in really good shape there. Well, let's see what Nick Wynn does. We see a Latios coming down. Um, okay, with the fast raid, and there we see a battle compressor going to discard three cards out of their deck. Oh man, I'm, this is an interesting deck. I'm not sure what we are playing against here. Um, Sableye Hydrogen to give his Pokemon, uh, his Dragon Pokemon free retreat if that two. Or less. Uh, they would see. Oh, it's some kind of Ho Oh deck. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ho uh Oh. Uh, they would see a Hypnotoxic Laser. Let's see. Nope. Our Shebe goes to sleep. There's a Dark Engine going to Hydrogen. Okay. All right. All right. I like what I see. I, I like what I see so far. <laughs> um. Well, let's see. Uh, well, us so with Nick Wynn to use Tropical Beach. They did last turn, so they could Tropical Beach once again. Nope, just gonna Junk Hunt, gonna get two item cards out of the Discard Power and put it into their hand. And let's see what they decide to grab. Uh, there's a laser and a letter. Okay, we we'll take 10 damage because of poison. Let's see, do we wake up or not? And we do, great for us. Alright, so under our turn, we draw it in, and I guess we'll just play the end. We really don't have anything else to play right as of right now. I will draw new hand cards and okay. Still didn't get what we need, but at least we get another kill duo. We can lightning energy the Reiku. And I guess we'll just drop a beach. Uh and <laughs> we still don't have enough energy, so I'll worry. I guess we're energy it just being energy dry right now. Um okay. So into my opponent's turn. Let's see does what does Nick win do here. I mean, he's had a turn to put a Dark Energy on the Sableye. He's got another Hydrogen. Maybe another Dragon Pokemon? Oh, what, what other Dragon Pokemon could he play? Uh, the the other Hydrogen EX. Oh, there's a Sharpedo. Okay. Um, with the, with the, what is it, Sharpedo? Jagged Fang, Fang and Hunt. Uh, there we see a Scramble Switch. Going to send up the Sharpedo. Oh, buddy. Let's see who's he going to hunt. Uh, switch one of your opponent's bench Pokemon with their act Pokemon. This tag does 30 damage to the new Pokemon. Let's see who hunts up. There's a Hoopa as well. Hoopa's going to search for three EX Pokemon. Oh, buddy. What will we see? Maybe a Mega Latios? Um, what other surprises will my opponent have? Oh, nothing. And we'll just we'll just Juniper. Never mind. Fossil Arm. No Hoopa. Um, Got to save that bench pop for the Ho-Oh, I guess. I don't... I don't Okay, um, let's see. They could, he could, uh, get out Ho-Oh, energy switch up to the Sharpedo, and Jagged Fane for a knockout. Oh, that's a possibility. There, a random receiver, uh, random receiver flip cards over to hit a supporter card. We haven't seen that card in such a long time, but there it is being played, getting a life center for next turn. Oh, buddy. And let's see who my opponent will jack, my, will my opponent use Hunt, uh, Nope, he just passed, actually. Okay, so he just passed with the shame and taking 30 more damage. And, oh, man. Oh, buddy. Where is our course at? It's, it's hiding right now. So, a verse Seeker grabbing an in. Will we get a Lightning Energy card to actually knock out the Sharpedo? It literally is weak to Lightning. If we get a single Dark a Lightning Energy, we can knock him out this turn. <laughs> okay, good. We got him. I was, I was, I was a little bit nervous. I'm not going to lie. Alright, so we will use Magnezone, Lightning Energy to the Reiku, Lightning Energy to the Reiku, press cancel, oh, it already automatically press cancel, retreat into the Reiku, 
put down the tropical beach and we will thunder lance for the knockout and there it is uh doing what 240 uh, 260, even better. Oh, because 130, and then yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why I thought 240. Uh, there we see a Magnezone and an Ultra Ball. Um, Let's see. Do we have Sky? Oh, we do. So next turn, what we could do, I don't know if it's in the deck, but we can actually Ultra Ball for the Dualberry Magnezone, Burst Seeker for Skyla, get the Skyla out, so you get the Rare King and Magnezone, and the Dual Brains, but there we see Lysander, Bringing up Shea Bay. No, don't, don't be, why do you keep picking up my Shaman? Don't do that. Why would Nick win? Stop doing that. A laser. Uh, let's see if Shea Bay stays asleep. And nope, nope, he's not asleep. And let's see what Nick win does here. <laughs> oh, sorry about the hiccup. And let's see, what will Nick win do now? What other surprises will we see? We got to remember that he has Ho-Oh at any moment. And now Ho-Oh will get the full rainbow rebirth bird or the full full rebirth ability if he wants to there's an absolute can move three damage counters any way he wants to and will we see cursed eyes coming to effect we saw hoopo come down but didn't didn't see it play we see 30 damage move from shaman onto the magna zone and a super scoop up heads will, will he pick up oh, picks up the absol and will he reuse it yes he will put down the absol once again and let's see, where does that damage move from? Uh, the 20 damage can move onto this Magna Zone, I guess. I guess. I don't I don't know. I don't know. We'll find out together. We'll find out together in Pokemon Land. Uh, okay. Now the damage move from 30 damage to Magna Zone to the Reiku. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Maybe, maybe he just wasn't happy with the 30 damage onto this guy, so he put on this Raikou. There we see a Grass Energy, so we could see Confuse Rain now. Um, so, oh, nope, just a Shockle Beach. Alright, so Poison comes in 10 damage. And on to our turn. Alrighty. Well, we can Ultra Ball, discard the end and the Hex Maniac. And let's see if Dual Brain Magnezone is in the deck. And it is in there. Alrighty, so now we can start using two supporter cards per turn. I probably should have saved the end. No, 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 we don't need to save the end. So grab a Verse Seeker, getting the Skyla. Are we all at, have we used all of our Verse Seekers? I think we might have. Uh nope, not grabbing Lysander. Getting a rare candy. We can rare candy into the Magnazone. Um, not that one. Make sure we click the right one, the dual brains. And one two oh my goodness, we're out for all four of our verse seekers. Great. Alright, so we'll sycamore, discard your hand, draw on a seven new cards. We can uh I guess magnetic circuit, put a light energy onto the Reiku. Um, and we can retreat into the Reiku. It will actually put the, uh, we'll focus on the, the Keldia as well. And here we'll Thunder Lance. I'm not even sure how much damage it's doing. It is doing 150. All right, take that, Sableye. Now, <clears throat> man, I just kind of hate that we played all of our Verse Seekers already. One, two, three, four. But we haven't played Lysander yet. So Lysander is still in the deck. Maybe we'll consider that for the late game. And there we see Hydra coming up. If it gets a double dragon energy, it could do shred for 80. What the muscle man could be 100, which could actually knock us out. Oh, buddy. Let's see if my opponent will do that. There we see a rebirth. Tails. And he gets another rebirth shot since he has two ho-ho's in the discard pile. And there's another rebirth. Oh, double tails. Oh, man. I feel bad for my opponent. But my opponent still has the opportunity. If he plays double dragon energy, he could attach a double dragon energy to the hydrogen. But there we see a psychic energy going down to it. And I'm just, I'm just trying to see my lightning energies. Another hypnotoxic laser. Going to try to put our Reiku to sleep, and it does. Now, if he plays a hex maniac and we stay asleep, it could be in trouble. Uh, but let's see if that happens or not. There's an end. Both players are going to shuffle their hand to deck and draw as many prize cards they have left. Of course, we'll get three, and they get six. And now, uh, let's see what do we get. There's a superior super rod and a rare candy. Okay. <laughs> And what else does Nick win have for us? Uh, will he put down a Verbank? Will he tro will will he Tropical Beach as well up to seven? Um, will we wake up? Right now we're only doing 130, 150, 170. That is not a knockout. I think it's 175, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 40, 15. Yeah, so we need one more Lightning Pokemon to knock out this Hydrogen. So uh, there's a switch. We're gonna switch into the Latios. There's an Energy Switch. Going to put energy up to Latios, and because he had fast raid for 40, uh, the poison, bring it up to 50, so that could bring it up to uh, 80 total. What? 
Oh, because of shiny body. Okay, we're good. But we stay asleep, but we're okay. We well, we're not okay. I guess we'll rush in retreat into the other Reiku. And we'll do Tropical Beach. I guess that's our best play right now. So Tropical Beach and we get a lightning energy for next turn so we can knock out this Latios. Um five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Yeah, we can knock it out next turn. And uh what will he do afterwards? He could rainbow burn and knock us out. There we see an absolute coming down. It could move well, I don't know what it could do, actually. I don't know. He probably should have conserved the th uh there we see 30 damage. Going on to the, the Reiku. He he really doesn't like this Reiku. It has 30 HP left. Let's see, does he have a Lysander? He could Lysander Reiku and knock it out right now. No, could he? No. No, he can't. It only does 20. Okay. Just making sure. So we see a laser heads. My opponent's really good at flipping laser heads. And there we see another end for my opponent. We're gonna get three prize cards or three cards once again. And let's see, do we draw into yes! We got a chorus and a lightning energy. We are good to go. So next time we can knock out this Latios and uh, keep the party going for sure. Uh, there we see a dark energy going to the Hydrogen. And we'll probably just see a fast rate for the knockout. I mean, I can't really imagine anything else. Rebirth. Oh, buddy. Okay, so Rebirth's coming in play right now. So you can Rebirth. Attach three different energies to it. There's I can't see what energies are being attached to it. I, I, don't, I don't know what he's attaching to it. I just see things flying in the air to the hoe. It could be anything. It could be anything. I don't. I don't know what it is actually. Um. So it's a. It's a, got a dark psychic and a water energy attached to it. Okay. Okay. All right. And there's an energy switch. Gonna bring an energy to the hydrogen or to the Latios. Uh, okay, to the hydrogen. We could see a shred. It could do 80, and we are at 120, so we'll have 40 HP left. Uh, but the poison, so 90, or do 90, so we have 30 HP left. And uh, if the Hydra could come up, does he have a muscle band and a verbing? That could actually 8, 19, 11, 12, 13. Uh, no, but we have, sh uh, we don't, yeah, it's, it actually, I was going to say shiny body is in effect, but it's not in effect. Uh, but we wake up, and all to our turn, we can use Magnazone, Magnetic Circuit, down to the Reiku. We can play the course, getting 10 whole cards alrighty our first course of the game getting 10 cards and we can't play any of them i mean we could play sycamore or that's about it we'll put another light energy on the on the uh reiku because we have to to actually knock it out i think so i will rush in retreat into this reiku okay and we will use the Shining, uh, the Thunder Lance for the knockout, I think, I believe. I think it's a knockout. Yeah, 190. So we needed the other Lightning Energy because Hydrogen does have 180. And we go down to one price card. Oh, buddy. We might see some crazy Pikachu play next turn. That's what I'm going to aim for. I try to get all 10 energies on Pikachu. Hopefully my opponent does knock me out. All right, he does. He, I want him to knock me out now. Um, please knock me out, opponent. So that way you can get down to Pikachu. Use Fisherman. There we see a Psychic Energy. Does he have an energy switch? He could use Mine Mock Claw to sturdy damage. And I can use Fisherman next turn, double superior, if we have enough energies in the discard pile. Um, I don't think we do, actually. Oh, well, see, my opponent could end me down to one, and we could be in bad trouble. But nope, just a Juniper. And let's see what they draw into. They could, like I said, just retreat into Fast Raid and could knock us out as well. I don't know why he just didn't send up in the beginning. They ever see a laser trying to put us asleep. Tails, uh, okay. Please retreat to Latios and knock us out. Okay, there's an energy switch regardless. So he's going to take a knockout with Absol. I didn't think I'd ever get knocked out with Mock Call Axe Absol, but here it is today. It's happening, and my opponent will go down to five prize cards. But next turn, hopefully, we can get all the energies in play on to this uh, Pikachu. We see another Absol coming down. Okay. <laughs> and where was that 30? <laughs> Is that four Absols? I feel like that's four Absols. Uh, so we see a knockout on the Reiku. Fair enough. Uh, we'll send up the other Reiku. Okay. And we could see a Mock Call for 30. Um, I think he's played all of his lasers. It felt like he's played a billion lasers. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, tw
two, three, four. So all the lasers are gone. There is a mock call for 30 and on to our turn. All right, put down Pikachu. We'll use Fisherman. Getting one, two, three, four. Okay. And we'll use Superior Energy Shivel to discard Pikachu and Shaman. We'll get two more energies. Or three more. Okay. So right now we have, uh, I don't know how many energies that is. We'll use Magnetic Circuit and we'll attach all the lightning to the Pikachu. So we're going to, I think we're going to win this turn. Uh, lightning. 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 Okay. Just give me a second to attach all these lightning energies. So there's four. There's five. There's six, up oh, seven, up oh, seven, eight. Okay, so there's two more energies left. Can we hit him or not? Uh, so eight, we'll Sycamore, and let's see, discard your hand and draw in. No, I think we whiffed it. Oh, no, we whiffed the Lice Lightning Energy. Oh, well. Well, sit up the Pikachu, and we will use a second attack, and let's see how much damage it is. I actually don't know how much it is. We'll find out here in a second how much it does. We'll set up the Kaladio. Retreat into the Pikachu. We just missed one lightning energy, I think. And we will overspark. And I think it does 450. Oh my goodness. We just did 450 damage to Pikachu EX. And there we go. Pikachu EX doing 450 damage to that poor Absol. And we take the victory screen with the dual brain Magnezone, Magnezone, Reiku, Pikachu deck. Uh, it's pretty crazy. 15 tokens. Uh, yep, there we go. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. You can see the power of Magnazone and Magnazone Dual Brains. I think it's a cool concept how you can use both supporter cards. You know, like we saw a second ago, you can Fisherman and use Sycamore. We just had a really bad game because we had to discard all four first Seekers, but we still made it out versus, versus the Absol, 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 Hoopa, Latios, Hydrogen deck. Did I, did, oh, ho oh, oh, don't forget the ho oh, oh. But hopefully you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Maybe on Sunday we might see a new version of this deck. I'm still tweaking it, and I do have to go to work early, so I, I didn't have that much time to find a good game. Uh, but hopefully you enjoyed this game. You kind of see the concept of the deck. Oh, you have a great Thursday. Thanks for watching. Alrighty. Bye.